Okay, USA. Welcome to Flag Stewards. Be a stud citizen. Remind us from our flag for Friday, April 16th of 2021. So where's our flag, the US flag at half staff today? So that all you students and citizens across this great land know for your school, home, or business. Well, we've got three new half staffs, Michigan, Iowa, and Virginia to be aware of. If you click on the link below, you can find out about those uh, honorees and the details of those half staffs. Today's historical moment from our flag tells us, yeah, tells you to get out there and enjoy America's treasures, the beautiful outdoor nature of America. On this date, April 16th in 1908, the Natural Bridges National Monument was created and protected by the National Park Service. Yeah, that looks pretty freaky, doesn't it? Um, a span that long of rock just amazing because of its remote off the beaten path off the beaten path <laughs> gotta fix that spelling error uh location in the southeastern utah yeah about 50 miles from the four corners and i've been in the four corners that is the middle of nowhere so now we're 50 miles from that yeah this is uh, definitely out there the natural bridges are one of the least visited national monuments and i can understand why it's hard to get to there are 158 national monuments across the usa and, um, wow, it looks spectacular at night too, doesn't it, if you see it that way. So if you have the opportunity, I guess go out and see one of the least visited uh, spots ever. Uh, one of these years I'll have to try that since we're here in Colorado. Um, southeastern Utah isn't that far. So maybe we'll make that trip someday. Today's inspirational quote from our flag. In every walk with nature, one receives far more than one seeks. By John Muir, father of our national parks. We just talked about him and his... Uh... Oh no, that's going to be coming up. Him and his birthday. Sorry, I'm working ahead, thinking of days I've already written uh, the content for. And today's fun from our flag is a riddle for you. In many stories or movies... I'm called clever or sly, but I'm just like any other cool guy. My coat is red, my cousin's is gray, and my long poofy tail is in need of some hairspray. Who am I? Yeah, and I have a little fun gift there. Holy weird riddles, Batman. I'm a fox. That's right, you probably got that already. All right. So we had some fun with our flag. We had an inspirational quote. I need to set up the link so you can uh, look at the list of national monuments of places you can go visit this spring or summer. And this is all uh, part of our flag steward. Be a stud citizen reminders from our flag where sometimes we talk about civics and being a good citizen. Other times we give historical moments. Uh, and sometimes we give flag instruction. Um, it's just all about... Uh, being a better American, as we call it, be a stud citizen, being awesome, good to each other citizens. And with that, now it's time to recite the pledge. Students across America at home or school, inspired by America's beauty, please unite and recite the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. That's it. That's our U.S. flag tribute for today. This is Sean Sweeney, a fellow flag steward, signing off with Go Out and Be a Stud Citizen. As I told you, that means being awesome, good to each other, citizen, especially in light of all the craziness going on. Um, <laughs> just too much to even talk about now. Keep America beautiful. Yes, it is beautiful on the outside. We just need more beauty on the inside between each other. And remember, in God, we trust. God will pull us through this somehow, make us a better, stronger nation for it.